Hey everyone, Derek Buckley here, creator of Moto Cuffs. Go grab a beer and I'll show you the easy, fast way to roll your sleeves with my product, Moto Cuffs. Now that you've grabbed your beer, go ahead and grab your Moto Cuff. First thing you're going to do is measure your bicep with the plastic. Wrap it around your arm where your sleeves would normally lie, but make sure you have it loose enough to where you can slide it off your arm just like so. Okay, so the next thing you're going to do is lay your blouse out just like so, so the entire sleeve is flat. And then the next thing you're going to do is take that moto cuff and you're going to slide it over the sleeve just like so, leaving about three inches between the moto cuff and the edge of the blouse just like so. Alright, so next you're going to go ahead and flip the end of that sleeve over the moto cuff all the way around just like so. It's important that you make sure that the end touches all the way around of that wonderful moto cuff just like that. So the next thing you're going to do is you're going to roll your sleeve up just like so all the way around. I need you to ensure that you start on one side and then follow it all the way around until it pops into place. It's a sturdy material, so you can give it a little bit of force, but make sure you aren't going from each side just like so. Start from one side, which each fold, and go all the way around just like so. All right, after your third roll, you're gonna find the inseam that runs along the armpit of your blouse right here. Next, you're gonna fold that inboard just like so and you're going to take the slack out all the way around your moto cuffs just like this. Now once you get the excess you're going to pull that into the crease that you developed on the inside inseam Next, you're going to go ahead and roll it again, starting on one side, following it all the way around like you've been doing the entire time, pop it into place. That is your fourth roll, folks. Next, you're going to find that inseam again, do the exact same thing you did last time, pull all that excess slack in, create a seam just like so. Now follow that bad boy all the way around, pulling the slack out all the way around and then stuffing the excess material in the cuff just like so. Alright so this is going to be your fifth fold, the last and final fold that needs to be the sexiest fold. Go all the way around just like you've been doing. I like to uh, roll mine a little bit high so I like to cut that pocket in half just like so. But like I said it's the last and final roll so we need to dress this thing up, we mean to make it look sexy. So again, take all the slack out, follow it all the way around, flatten everything out, and again, put all that excess into the cuff that you created. There you have it folks, you have a three inch fold that's going to stay three inches the entire week. It also has an elastic band on the inside, so it's going to stay tight and close fitting to your arm throughout the entire week as well. I hope that it helps you out in uh, rolling your sleeves and it cuts your time in half. Now you have a ton of time to sit back, relax, and have a good day.